Welcome back, Knights. This is Night Vision News bringing you the latest stories on August 18th, 2022. Welcome back, Knights. To start off today's episode, we have some great news regarding our amazing art teacher. Mrs. Williams' artwork will be exhibited at the art windows of El Paso Gallery at the El Paso International Airport from August 22nd through October. The official opening is on August 22nd at 1 p.m., so if you have a chance, stop by to support. Do you need some community service hours? Today is your lucky day. For a community service opportunity on Sunday, September 11th, talk to Ms. Monica Lopez in the Early College Office. Class of 2024, those of you that are in early college, there will be a parent meeting today at 6 p.m. in the theater. Make sure to be there. Do you have a passion for fashion? If so, our Stellar Fashion Club will be hosting their first meeting of the school year in room 700 today at 4.06 p.m. We hope to see you there. A friendly reminder that there will also be a DECA meeting today after school, so please save the date. With the new year comes new struggles. If you find yourself having a hard time understanding certain concepts, the tutoring center is officially open. It will be open from Monday to Thursday after school in room 406, so you can get help with just about any content. So stop by today. Cross Country is having their popcorn fundraiser. Buy some delicious popcorn that will be delivered straight to your door. There are many mouth-watering and delicious options, and if that wasn't enough to convince you, all money raised will go straight to the Cross Country and Track Team. Please support our night runners and enjoy some popcorn that's sure to be better than any other snack. You will find the link to buy at the YouTube description of this newscast. It's time for sports. Last Tuesday, our Valiant Volleyball team played Franklin High School. Unfortunately, in a nail-biter of a game, they fell against the Cougars. But don't worry, Knights. Learning from your mistakes will make you better. We'll get them next time. Before we let you go, we also have our first night casted of the year. Night Vision producer and broadcaster Jessica Hill presents our newest social studies teacher, Marco Rodriguez. Roll tape. And this week on Night Casted, we present the kingdom's new social studies teacher, Marco Rodriguez. So I've been teaching for, for five years. I started in, in middle school and this is the beginning of my sixth year. My goal was always just to kind of become a, a high school teacher at some point. So when I got started in teaching, uh, my first job was at middle school, so I was like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna just make the best of it. But I enjoyed it, it was fun, but you know, now I'm really happy that I'm actually kind of at, at Hanks and at a, at a high school teaching, so. Teaching at Del Valle Middle School before he moved here, Mr. Rodriguez has always wanted to pursue his dream of teaching high schoolers. He went to Coronado High School and attended UTEP and Arizona State University. For my content, like with social studies, I, I kind of like the subject matters that we're teaching in, in high school. So I like, I like world geography, I like world history, um, the part of American history that we teach, which is kind of like uh, from the end of the Civil War to the more modern stuff. I, I kind of studied, studied that in, in college, so for me that was kind of like what I wanted to be teaching. So I love it. I love it. Uh, middle school was challenging, but it's really cool to, no matter what you're doing, you're making good connections with students, having, you know, you know you're teaching them, but then you're also getting to know them in a little more personal aspect. So I think that's one of the best parts of teaching, whether it's middle school and now that I'm kind of getting into high school, it's, it's kind of what drives me, you know, teaching them, but then you're also getting to know them and helping them out become better people. He stresses how important it is to focus in class and that high school really is hard. He truly does care about his students and his optimistic attitude shows. My goals for this year is to survive the content. It's even though I really enjoy it there is like a certain way of teaching it and just trying to learn all that stuff for the first year is going to be a challenge but I, I think it should be cool the team that I'm with with the other teachers very helpful so I'm, I'm looking forward to it. And that was Marco Rodriguez, the Kingdom's newest member. My name is Jessica Hill at the Kingdom of Champions. For Night Vision News, Nightcasted. And that's all for the top stories of the day. Follow the KVN YouTube channel, Twitter, and TikTok accounts so you don't miss out on all the latest updates. This has been co-anchor Judith Olivas for Night Vision News. Have a charming day. See you next time.